Hem just shook his head. Oh ho, he murmured. What were you thinking? Cheese is either there or it's not. Beliefs have nothing to do with it. For the first time, he wondered if Ho might have gotten too weak to go on and simply given up. He wondered if that's what was happening to himself right now. All at once, he felt alone and afraid. Nothing was the way it used to be. Before, the maze was where Ham and Ho had worked and had a social life. They both grew up there and built their lives there. The maze was Ham's world. But the maze had changed. Now it seemed as if everything was different. Ho was gone, Sniff and Scurry were gone, the cheese was gone, and he was out wandering the corridors, getting weaker and weaker. Ham didn't understand why all this was happening. The maze had become a dark and scary place. He curled up on the floor and fell into a troubled sleep. Hem stirred and felt his foot bump up against something on the floor where he lay. A few somethings. He sat up and looked at them. They were round little rocks about the size of one of his fists. He picked one up and felt its smooth, shiny red surface. It wasn't a rock at all. It smelled good. In fact, it smelled so good. Hem wanted to take a bite. He shook himself. What was he thinking? Whatever this was, it certainly wasn't cheese. It might be dangerous. He looked around and almost jumped. There was another little person sitting nearby watching him. It wasn't Ho, and not any of their old friends either. Hem had never seen this little person before. He didn't know whether to smile and say hello or to be afraid. The little person lifted up one of the little red knot rocks and held it out toward him. You looked hungry, she said. But I can't eat this, said Ham. It isn't cheese. Isn't what? Cheese, Ham repeated. It isn't cheese. She didn't say anything, just looked bemused. Cheese is another word for food, Ham explained patiently. Everyone eats cheese, even the mice. Ah, said the other little person. They were both quiet for a moment. Then she said, I don't. I've never even seen cheese. Ham found this hard to believe. A little person who didn't eat cheese? Impossible. The stranger was still holding the little rock out toward him. He looked at it and shook his head. Whatever it is, I can't eat it, he said. I only eat cheese. He lay back down again, feeling hopeless. After a few moments, he half heard the stranger say, I'll bet you can do a lot more than you think you can. But Ham had already drifted off again.